don't know what I'm talking about. I don't even remember sending this email. And then I see it was sent by another Adam Kogan. G'day team, Adam Kogan here from SSW TV. And today I'm talking about something really, really important. And that is getting stuff done. And the best way to get stuff done is by delegation, right? Wrong. It's about delegation and follow-up. And thankfully I learned this a long, long time ago. And it has been a really important thing that I've used throughout my career. Now, initially I worked by myself and I would follow up myself, especially for tasks that took a while to do. And one of the things that I really needed this technique for was when I was learning how Google indexed before it was documented and it wasn't a popular search engine. And so I'd make a change and I had to wait a month for Google to index itself. So I would send myself, I'd make the change, I'd send myself the email, and then I'd check what had happened in the uh, search. So I would send myself an email, and uh, then when Google had indexed itself after a month, I would see what effect that had on the search results. And I became quite good at uh, SEO with Google through that technique. I was always uh, sending myself emails. One day I get an email from myself, Adam Kogan, and uh, it says something like, I'm trying to get myself on the first page of Google, but you're taking up all the pages and I don't know how to do it. And I'm, I'm thinking, what am I talking about? I don't know what I'm talking about. I don't even remember sending this email. And then I see it was sent by another Adam Kogan uh, in America. He was from Providence and... Uh, and I always remember being spun out trying to understand what I was saying to myself. But anyway, there are three main ways of following up and I'll show you what they are. So the first way is pop open an email and you send yourself an email. And I would you know, send myself an email to do a task. And the way you do that is you come up to the options menu and you come over here to delay and you put the date there. I might make that a month in the future and then I'm going to press close and I usually don't want to see too much of the toolbar because I want more space for what I'm doing. But there is a better way of doing it. You can click on here, right click, see how it's depressed, that means that it's been set. I can right click and go add to quick access toolbar. I will do that and then it's there in the toolbar and I can click and see the setting that I just set. Cool. So that is the uh, first way. The second way of doing things, and uh, this way I use mostly on my mobile phone because it doesn't have the delay delivery feature. I'd open up an email. I'd send an email to myself or to someone else. And in this case, I would say I want to follow up myself in one month, and I use follow up then. I could make that one month or two months or one day. Uh, whatever I put in the front here, uh, it will send it to me just then. And I'll receive that in my inbox. It will trigger me to do something. The third way of doing something is by using the follow-up feature. See here, the follow-up feature. So you can flag it to follow up. So they are the three main options. I'm super keen to know which method you prefer the most or if you have a better way. I'm always keen to learn and I will see you in the next one. This is Adam Kogan signing off for SSW TV.